fifth grade lesson 53 and this is on perimeter and then also we're going to do measures of a circle okay let's talk about perimeter first do you know what this word means perimeter no no okay write this word down i'm going to show you what it means okay the perimeter is the distance around distance around something and those some things that we're going to be working with is polygons so any kind of shape okay remember how we talked about polygons mm -hmm. all right um distance around a polygon so for example okay this is let's say we had a backyard and we put up a fence we put fencing all around it i need to know how much fencing i needed i'm actually finding the perimeter okay so how far it is around so, for example, if this is three centimeters and this is two centimeters, okay? If this side is three centimeters, what's this side going to be? Three centimeters. Very good. And if this is two, what's this going to be? Two. Very good. So, the perimeter of this figure is the distance around it. So, if I go three plus two plus three plus two, what would I get? Um... 10? 10 centimeters. That would equal my perimeter. Okay? It's pretty simple. Got it? Uh -huh. Feel like you understand it? Yes. All right. So, now, let me draw a polygon up here. Remember what a polygon is? I'm yes. going to draw a three-sided polygon, which is called a what? Um, tripod. Triangle. Right. Tripod, that's what we're using. Triangle. Okay? This is a square. square, or what's a four-sided figure called? What? Qua quadrilateral. Quadrilateral, okay. Do you remember what a five-sided figure is? A... Pentagon. Pentagon. Okay. Then we've got a six-sided shape, and it's called a hexagon. hexagon. And then we, we're going to skip seven, and we're going to do eight. Octagon. Stop sign, eight. Octagon. Very good. Okay. Now, let's pretend I had perfect drawings, and that this was the same length as this, which was the same length of this. Okay. This, 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 and this all had the same length. This, 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 all the same length. Same here, same here. They would be called regular, regular triangle, regular quadrilateral, regular pentagon, regular hexagon, regular octagon. octagon. Do you know what that word regular means? Even though we, you would think it would mean like, oh, it's just a regular, whatever. Regular actually means exact. So these all have the exact measurements. So this is um, two inches, two inches, two inches. That's what makes it regular. So if you hear them say, draw a regular quadrilateral, they're basically telling you to draw a four-sided figure that has all the same lengths. Got it? Yeah. All right. Now, so this one's tricky, so listen to this. Here's all the information they give me. It says, what is the perimeter of this regular triangle? If that part is 12 inches, what am I going to do um, to find the perimeter of this? You count the other two sides. Okay, and what would the other sides be? 12. How do you know? Because it's regular. Very good. So 12 plus 12 plus 12, or 12 times 3, which is going to give us 36 and it's inches. Very good. Okay? So, you feel like you understand it? Uh-huh. All right. 36 inches. All right. Last thing we're going to learn is the measures of a circle. So draw a circle on mm -hmm. your page. Okay? Do you remember, okay, just a second ago I told you that a polygon, when you're measuring the distance around a polygon, what's it called? The, um, the new no, word. Don't tell me. Perimeter. Very good. Perimeter. Okay? Now, why is this not a polygon? Because remember, they don't have curved, yeah. remember? Polygons all have straight edges, okay? So this is a circle. 
So guess what? They don't call the distance around a circle the perimeter. They use a different name because perimeter is for polygons. Mm -hmm. You got it? So the name of the distance around a circle is circumference. And I try to draw it like that to show you that I'm going around. Okay. So I'm going to draw you a circle. You're going to have to have a bigger one than that. And you're going to write circumference on it, okay? That way you can write circumference around it. Circumference means the same thing as perimeter for a polygon. Circumference is for a circle. Got it? Uh-huh. Okay. Okay. All right. Now, the next thing I want to talk to, about, to you about is the center of the circle. Throw you a little dot. That's the center. Okay? Now, if I go from the center out to the edge, that is called the radius. Do you remember learning about remember this? this? Yep. Now, I could have drawn from here, 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 to here, here, to here. It doesn't matter. It's the center point to the edge. Okay? So it doesn't matter where it's located, where the line is located. It's, if it's from the center out, it's radius. Okay? okay? But what is from the side to the side called? Doesn't that start with an O? No, but good try. Okay? Yeah. It is called, let's write this one down, diameter. D-I-A-M-E-T-E-R. Diameter. Diameter is the distance across the circle from one side to the other or one edge to the other. Okay? Okay. And that is lesson 53. Pretty simple.